Isn't that um, uh, Gary's brother? What's his name? Hey, what brings you to Knott's Landing? Well, hello there, uh, Avery, isn't it? Yeah. How you doing? Yeah. You, you looking for Gary? Gary? At Abby's house? I guess you two don't stay in touch. Well, you know how it is between brothers. What's going on? Well, Gary moved in with Abby. Val's crossed the street with her mother, Lily Mae Clemens. Lily Mae. Well, when that all happened? A couple of weeks ago. Well, nice, friendly little neighborhood you got here. <laughs> <laughs> More like a war zone. Yeah. Nice seeing you. Nice seeing you, Avery. It's all right. I'll uh, just be a minute. Eileen, this is a woman's magazine. It's not a literary journal. Sure, they're going to exploit the connection. And so what? <sighs> well, I just hate it. That's so what? I mean, I never intended it for, to look like that. Surprise. Well, don't just stand there with your mouth hanging open. Aren't you going to give your favorite brother-in-law a big kiss? <laughs> what do you want? Uh, well, I was doing a little business in town. I thought I'd drop by. I, I suppose I should have called her. Yes, you should have. Gary's not here. When's he coming home from work? Valine, when, when's Gary coming home? Gary and I aren't together anymore. What? I said that Gary and I have separated. Separate? Uh, separated from what? We're separated from each other. You mean, uh, separated like, uh, you split up? Yes. Oh. Oh, golly, I'm sorry to hear about that. <laughs> Gosh, I need a drink. Well, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to say that either. <sighs> well, I hope it's just temporary. Uh, am I being indiscreet or... No, don't look at me. I'm just her editor, Joe Cooper. Her editor? Oh, well, it is true then. You know, there's been rumors flying all around Dallas about a book called uh, Corn Crude or Crude Porn or Corn Porn. Capricorn Crude. Yeah, that's it. Capricorn Crude, yeah. Supposed to be all about my family. Well, I was tickled to death here about that. Of course, uh, that's more than I could say for my mama and Sue Allen. I, but I told my mama not to worry about anything, because uh, who would want to read about us anyhow, huh? Well, it's not about the family. It's 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 just a novel. Oh, I see. It's uh, fiction? Yes. Oh, well, I'm kind of disappointed in that. Real life is a hell of a lot more interesting than fiction. You of all people should know about that, Belly. Well, you're going to want to read this book when it comes out. It'll be a blockbuster. Yeah, well, I don't know. Book business kind of dice here. Everybody's watching TV nowadays. Uh, you got some iced tea there, sweetheart. Yes, that's iced tea. I'd... Probably need a glass, won't you? Thank you. Thank you. But publishing is really in bad shape. But Kismet Press, that's Val's publisher. I'm sorry. But... <laughs> it's all right. Val's publisher is going to be taken over by a Chicago based conglomerate. That is, at least they made an offer. I think. Well, I hope. Because they really like the book. Needham Enterprises. You ever heard of them? Needham Enterprises. Uh, yeah, I think the granddaddy was in the uh, meatpacking. And boys branched out and uh, supposed to be a pretty good outfit. As a matter of fact, I think they got offices in Dallas. Say, would you want me to nose around when I get back home? Oh, thanks. It's pretty much a fait accompli. Ah, uh -huh. well, I don't know much about literary business, but, you know, my business is a thing. Uh, when, uh, when a big fish eats a little fish, there's blood in the water. You know what I mean? Thank you. Thank you. Ah, <laughs> oh, Valine, you still got away with iced tea. Uh, Thank you. Look, I've got to be run along. I, I think you got a real winner here, darling, and it's about time to. Nice seeing you. Good, good meeting you. <clears throat> well. Well, well, Lily Mae Clemens, what a pleasant surprise. Now, let, let me take this. Darling, that sure is a pretty little thing you got there. <laughs> oh, I, I just love what you all done with this room. It's, um, it's really you. Good talking to you. Bye. What's he doing in this house? If I'd have known that, Mama, I wouldn't have let him in. <laughs> 